is God. Alleluia. Praise God. Amen. What shall I say unto the Lord? All I have to say, thank you, God. What should I say unto the Lord? All I have to say, thank you, God. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. All I have to say, thank you, God. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. All I have to say, thank you, God. We have started our online prayer. Let's keep it for next now. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. All I have to say, thank you, God. Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Pastor Paul Ben from Germany, can you please emote yourself, Pastor Paul? Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Yeah. I welcome everybody on this prayer platform in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Um, we are believing God tonight that the Lord in his power, the Lord in his mercy, the Lord in his goodness we walk mightily upon our life. And at the end of the prayer online tonight, the Lord will restore everything the enemy have carried out of our life, spiritually, maritally, socially, academically, in every ramification, the power of God will bring a restoration upon our life, even tonight, in Jesus' name. Amen. We pray, we are believing God that tonight, the, uh, our members, uh, those who will still connect, God will give us a breakthrough tonight. And the Spirit yes. of God will help us so that by the grace of God, every prayer item and every revelation we may receive tonight, it will be a plus in our life in Jesus' name. Amen. Let's pray together. Our Father and our God, the God of battle, the God that never lost any battle, the creator, the mighty God, the powerful God. I bless you for the I gift of life. I bless you for your preservation in our lives. I bless you for your keeping power. I give you the glory. I give you the honor. Father, receive all our praise. Receive all the adoration as we come tonight to pray. As we come tonight to seek your face, we pray tonight, oh God, in every of our life, in Jesus' name. Amen. We thank you because we believe you have answered. Let's begin to worship the Lord. Let's appreciate him. Let's give him the glory due unto his name. Open your mouth and appreciate the Lord of kings, the Lord of lords, and the ancients of days. Let's give him the glory due unto and it's worthy to be praised. Praise the Lord, oh my soul, and all that is within me. Praise His holy name. Open your mouth and show gratitude unto our God. Is our is the God of the heavens and the earth? Is the God that never lost any battle? Is He greater than the greatest? The I am that I am. The Almighty God. Bless the Lord, oh my soul. Our God is worthy of our praise. Our God is powerful. Our God will never fail. Our God will never disappoint us. Give Him the glory. Give Him the honor. Give Him the adoration. Glory be to His name. Honor be to His name. 
We bless your name. We worship your name. We glorify your name. We exalt your name. Thank you for the gift of life. Thank you for your power. Thank you for your glory. Thank you for your presence. We worship you. We bless you. We glorify you. Open your mouth and show gratitude unto our God. Open your mouth and exalt his holy name. Our God is a great God. Our God is eternal God. Because tonight is going to do great and mighty seed in our midst. Tonight is going to manifest his power in our life. Tonight is going to take us to the next level of deliverance, the next level of dominion. Is going to take off a new dimension. Let's give him the glory for what he's going to do tonight. Let's appreciate him for what he is going to do tonight. Let's worship him because every fetter, every shackles, every yoke will be broken tonight. Worship the Lord and bless his holy name. Give him the glory due to his name. Father, we want to thank you for the gift of life. We want to bless your name. We come to worship you. We come to glorify you. There is no one we can compare with you. Ancient of days, the King of kings, the Lord of lords, the God that never lost any battle, the God that has been in their world before the world began. We bless your name. We worship your name. We glorify your name. We exalt your name. We give you all the glory due unto your name. We say thank you, Father. For your love and compassion. We say thank you, Father, for your goodness and preservation. We say thank you, Father, for the manifestation of your presence in our life. We say thank you, Father, for the dominion in our life. We say thank you, Father, for sustaining us and keeping us and making us to be alive today. We say thank you, Father, may your name be glorified. We worship, we bless you, we glorify you, we endorse you, we skip all the praises, we skip all the glory, we give all the honor, we skip all the honor. Adoration. Let your name be magnified. Let your name be glorified. We bless you, O oh God. Thank you for this day. Thank you for your mercy. Thank you for your compassion. Oh God, we are grateful. Oh God, we exalt you. Give him the glory of his name. Our God is great. Our God is powerful. Our is the ancient of days. Is the I am that I am. Is the rock of ages. Oh, praise the Lord, oh my soul. And Lord, that is within me, praise his holy name. 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 Matthew, please, people want to join the prayer online, and somebody has messaged me now that they cannot access the Zoom and other things. Please, I don't know, maybe you have other people to be host, so they can also help us to allow people inside the Zoom meeting. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. Once and again, men and brethren, our God will never fail. Our God is alive. And our God is the Almighty God. We are going to pray once again that tonight, let's ask the Lord to manifest His power in our midst. Open your mouth and pray. Say, Oh God, manifest your authority, manifest your power, manifest your glory. Oh God, manifest your power tonight in our midst. Open your mouth and pray. Call upon the Lord. That God will manifest His authority in our life. Manifest that God will manifest His power in, in our, our life. life. Manifest your authority in our life. Ask the Lord to manifest your power. Ask the Lord to manifest your strength. Manifest your authority. The God of heaven will manifest his power in our life more than never before. In the mighty name of Jesus. Manifest your greatness tonight. In the mighty name of Jesus. 
Tonight is going to be a night of recovery. Tonight is going to be a night of jubilee. Tonight is going to be a night of celebration. Tonight is going to be a night of the manifestation of the manifestation of the power of God in our lives. In our lives, in the name of Jesus. Let your name be glorified tonight. We pray. Amen. Our Father and our God, we bless your name because you are already here with us already. We pray as we want to go through the scripture now. We are asking, we are praying, you will open our eyes of understanding, and we pray you will give us understanding and help us to pray our right in Jesus' name. Amen. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. Amen. So tonight, very briefly, Amen. I will not take much time because I'm going to release you to pray. Uh, I'm talking, I'm addressing a subject today is battle against spiritual robbers. Battle against spiritual robbers. I read my text from John chapter 10, verse 10. The thief cometh not but for to steal and to kill and to destroy. I am come that they may have life and they may have it more abundantly. The thief cometh not but to steal to kill and to destroy in Matthew chapter 13, verse 25. In Matthew chapter 13, verse 25. But when men steal, and he came and so tears among the weak and went his way, verse 43. But know this that he, the good man of the house, has no what was it? He could have come. He could at worst I could not have suffered his house to be broken off. That is Matthew chapter 24, verse 43. Now I read first Peter chapter 5, verse 8. First Peter chapter 5, verse 8. The Bible says, But be sober, be vigilant, because your because your adversary, the devil, as a roaring lion, seeking who he may devour. Seeking who he may, be, who he may devour. Just as the physical robbers, thieves, so also we have spiritual robbers. Satan and his cohorts are out to rob people, the people of God. The devil bent on stealing anything precious, valuable and invaluable from God's children. The devil is not a lion, but he is like one. And to see God's people by his mission, he is said, and his whole fellow agent are wicked. The physical robbers attack physically, Spiritual robbers do not call when you are awake. They call when you are asleep. The Bible says, when men sleep, the enemy so tires. And when you oh, are like, at a sleep, oh, God. They, they are so specialized the line, in the, line, the, the best break in the family. At the in time, the they do an exchange of virtue by replacing the the name of Jesus. You know, there was a case of a woman in the name of Jesus. who showed a vision by a man of God. When he in the did you open home to see from the plantation, she is cultivating in Nepal. But this woman had written professional exam. A central attempt. This woman pray the prayer Thank of recovery God. and everything stolen was being returned in a dream. And she went back to write that exam Hello? as a past exam. She took me not to see, to kill, to destroy. Imagine a pregnant woman who I see, see a red object in in the in a dream. As she wake up to see the pregnancy come down spiritual robber 
The thief cometh not to steal, to kill, and to destroy. Here is a sister having several failures in marriage, only to realize later that a seed of marriage has been stolen in the dream. And this sister never had a successful marriage until she began to pray the prayer of recovery. And when she prayed that prayer, it was then God now restored her and marriage back to her. The thief commit not to see, to kill, and to destroy. There was a particular uh, sister that had a woman had a dream. In that dream, a woman approached her and the woman said, give me your wedding gown in that dream. The sister went in, she brought the wedding gown, she gave to this old woman. And the woman said, give me your wedding ring. In the dream, the sister also went in, she gave her a wedding ring. Do you know that dream come to realization? That the, that, that the husband of that sister, a strange woman, come and ajacked that, that husband and he took that husband away. The thief commit law to kill and to destroy. But when prayer was being made, that, 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 that husband is over and then she returned back to the wife. That is the work of the devil. There is another case of a pastor who ignorantly opened the door for Satan through adultery to steal his energy of ministry. In a dream, this pastor repented and realized a, a shift of his virtue have gone out. And the pastor pray in he pray in he as he pray and pray and pray. He had a dream again, and that dream that they they give that pastor a generator of two fifty k two fifty k VJ in in that dream, and then the Lord helped that pastor to recover what he has lost spiritually. He recover it, my dear brother, my dear sister. This is a serious issue. This is a serious issue we need to deal with. Many people have lost a lot of things through dream because it is the spiritual that control the physical. Let me tell you something. Now take this from me. When somebody's car is stolen in, in the physical realm, in the physical world, one can buy another car. But a cap stolen in the dream. Let me tell you something. That cap represents somebody's glory, his glory. And if you don't pray for recovery, the person will be neighboring under close heaven. The thief commit not to see to keep and to destroy. May I also tell you, a book stolen in the physical can be replaced by the owner. But when the uh, brain has been stolen in the dream, my dear brother, my dear sister, that represents the capture of that person's glory. The thief commit not to kill, to see, and to destroy. But Jesus Christ came that we may have life. Drug are good to take care of our body, and it can be replaced when it is lost in the physical. But a head stolen in the dream is a point of open door for all sicknesses that we come in. A head stolen in the dream. That can replace sicknesses and disease. In your, that if you have also similar dream, you need to pray against it and pray that God will help you to recover everything the enemy have carried away. Can you imagine? Money stolen by physical robbers can be replaced or at least gotten back by, 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 by the owner. But money stolen in the dream represents a total word stolen. Wherever you have such a dream, you saw that money has been stolen from, 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 from your pocket in the dream. Don't take it lightly. You have to pray that God will restore whatever that money signifies. The word stolen from you spiritually, that the Lord will restore such things back to you. What have I, have I, have I, have I not told you about wedding ring? Mm -hmm. <laughs> It's a symbol of unity in a marriage. It can be replaced by stolen physically, but a wedding ring stolen in the dream represents a collapse of marriage. I told you about a woman that uh, he had a dream that somebody came to her and he told her, give me your wedding garment. And he went and she gave her the wedding, the wedding garment in a dream. Mm -hmm. And the, the, woman also give, the woman also say, give me your wedding ring. And she went inside and brought that wedding ring to the woman. And he said, bye-bye, he went away. Do you know that, that the husband of that woman, a strange woman, I jacked that, that um, husband, huh? he took that husband away. 
the power right. of darkness. That is why right. right. you right. must arise and rest and, and pray, pray because the thief cometh not to see, to kill, and to destroy. But Jesus Christ came that we may have life and have it more abundantly. A car stolen by physical robbers can be replaced by the owner. But when a car stolen in the dream represent progress stolen from your life, progress taken away from your life, that is why you must pray against all this thing I mentioned in tonight. The thief commit more to kill, to, to steal, and to destroy. It is the physical, that is the spiritual that controls the physical. Physical instrument stolen physically can be replaced. But if such is stolen in the dream, yes, sir, that God. represents the joy of that person, the happiness of that person. Yes, you must pray for restoration of your joy and your happiness. The thief commit not to see, to kill, and to destroy. Yes, you know sir, what? We yes, need to take this matter very serious. A lot of people have lost yes, precious yes, things in their dream. A lot of people have lost significant things through their dream. And they began to neighbor on that close heaven. And mm -hmm. everything closed, no way for them but tonight. Everything the enemy have taken from your life as you pray tonight, the God of heaven will restore them back in your life in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 And the of of Jesus will work for you tonight. Whatever you have lost in the past, don't worry, we are going to repossess our possession. Whatever they have replaced. They take from me, they have replaced with child tonight. The and the marriage of the wife is not a part of the problem. And the marriage of the people being collapsed, the people coming to take their wedding ring, come to take their wedding garment, come to take their precious in their dream. And now there is trouble here and there, and there is confusion here and there. We are going to turn the people around tonight, and by the power of the Holy Ghost, the God will restore whatever you have lost, the Holy Ghost will restore whatever the enemy has taken away from your life, from your family, from your household, from your from your from your spiritual life, physical life, material life, or the restoration tonight. Jesus name, Amen. And it's going to be a night of jubilee because it's all the attempt that they, they, they steal this from your life, you it's lost this one from your life, you have a lot of money in, in, in your pocket, it's all of a sudden they all have to get carried to face away. And since that time, things are very difficult for you, you cannot stand 20,000, 40,000, 50,000 in your hand. Those things you can't put money, but now those things you, you see what is happening. Well, what happened to me? And you pray, you pray, nothing happened tonight. We all finish calling upon your life tonight. You are going the Philistine has carried and everything has carried away. And there is the power of God will cover them with glory. The power of the Lord and the Lord. But I will be able to thank you for your salvation. Thank you for what you have done. Thank you for covering. Thank you for your power. Give him the glory. Thank you for your honor. Because the Lord has given me the power of the Lord. You are the director of the Lord. You are the director of the Lord. You are the director of the Lord. We appreciate you, Father. Thank you for the glory. 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 In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. Please accept you are on a special duty that you are connecting, but if you are not on special duty, please immute yourself. 
in mute yourself. If you are not on the road, you are not in the, your place of work, maybe you are at home, please, you can mute yourself. Or if children are dis disturbing you, I understand, I understand. But you are just on your own, and please immerse yourself. And this is this this is the this is the hour of prayer. And if you if you don't immerse yourself and pray, and we pray together, this challenge will be lingering tonight. Every challenge, everything the enemy have carried away from your life tonight, oh. immerse yourself and let's pray together. There shall be full restoration back Amen. in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Now, pray once Amen. Again. Bible say, the Bible say, and the Lord, the Lord will recover it for you, will Amen. restore it for you. The Lord Amen. shall restore that to next you. The thing comes to be and to destroy. But Jesus Christ Amen. came that you may have life and have it more abundantly. abundantly. Whatever you have carried away from your life, you are going to pray, oh God, restore it. Oh Amen. God, restore it. The victory you call and carry out of my life. Oh God, Amen. restore it. Everything Amen. the enemy have carried away from my life. Oh. oh God, restore it. Restore my marriage. Oh God, restore it. I will restore to you the years the locust has eaten. They can't come home and the caterpillar. Pray the caterpillar. for restoration. The pray for recovering back. Father, in oh, the name of that Jesus. you have lost spiritual robbers. I commit my church into the Whatever spiritual robbers have carried away from in the past. All oh, upon the Lord that the Lord Almighty will restore Father, I pray it back to you. For the total the restoration of my health. I believe that the name of Jesus will open my you. church in two. Let my head be restored. Let my glory be restored. In the name of Jesus, I come in the name that is above every name. In the name of Father Jesus, Jesus Christ, name. let my head be restored in Jesus' name. Amen. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. 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 I please immerse yourself. Do yourself. This is not a tattered prayer. This is not quiet time. This is a prayer conference. Please immerse yourself and pray. It is not. It is not quiet time. You are not here for a baptism. You are here to pray. You are not here to listen to people's prayer. You are here to pray. And I, I, I am telling you once again, immerse yourself and pray. If you are in a special duty, or maybe children are disturbing you, I understand. But if not, be sincere, immerse yourself and pray. You are going to pray once and again. You are going to pray that the Lord God Almighty, every spiritual robber and son against your life and your family, oh God, arrest them. Oh Amen. God, arrest them. Oh Amen. God, arrest them. All of the Lord, every spiritual robber and fight against your life and your family, ask the Lord to arrest them on your behalf. All of the Lord, the spiritual robber has sent to a family, the spiritual robber has sent to a family, the spiritual robber has sent to you and your household. I stand against your marital life. I stand against your finances. I stand against your spiritual life. The power of the Lord will arrest them. Marriage, you are going to pray, oh Lord, open my dream life, 
with your power in order to wage war against any spiritual robbers. Oh Lord, fortify my dream life. Call upon the Lord that the Lord will fortify your dream life. The Lord will fortify your dream life. It is all these things. That is where they come to put all the garbage in your life that is manifesting. That is the people they come to put all the garbage, all the garbage that is manifesting in your life. God will fortify your dream life. They come spiritually. They come when you are asleep. They come and sort trials among the weak. They come and go carry to your village. Your valuable precious gift away. Oh, God, fortify my dream life. I want to make to wage war against spiritual robbers. As spiritual robbers, we are spiritual robbers. They come to carry joy away from your family. They come to carry happiness away from your from your from your family. My God, you have to fortify your children to wage war against spiritual robbers. And for that pray, my sister, pray. A lot of people have lost precious things in their dream life. Spiritually, physically, yeah. financially. We are going to pray. Every leakage that has opened doors to spiritual robbers in order to come to steal from you, you are going to ask the Lord, may the blood of Jesus block them. May the Amen. blood of Jesus block all the leakages in your life spiritually. Amen. Amen. Any leakages in your life spiritually as the blood of Jesus Christ, the fire of the Holy Ghost, to block them. To Amen. block them.
Open your mouth and pray. Father, in the name of Jesus, let me preach to your robber. Assign to my marriage. What are you waiting for? Oh, all your plan. Oh, I destroy it. In the name of Jesus, let me preach to your robber. Let them destroy my brother, do you know how many marriages are collapsed? My sister, do you know how many marriages are collapsed? Spiritual robbers at war. Spiritual robbers at war. Spiritual robbers call upon the Lord. The Lord will frustrate all their agenda. The Lord will frustrate all their evil agenda. In the name of Jesus, let us not frustrate all their evil agenda. In the name of Jesus, Lord, we may have life and that you may have it more over my family, over my life. Over my wife, over, over, over your children, over your family, over your Lord marriage, Jesus. over your job, over your husband. Oh, Today, this ritual of the Lord is high. I am to do my marriage. I to my wife. I to my wife. I to my wife. I said to my wife. I to my wife. I to my wife. I said to my wife. I said to my wife. I to my wife. I said 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 to my wife. I that human say go and bring your wedding ring. You went and brought the wedding ring. And you must say go and bring your wedding garment. You went and brought a wedding garment. That was the last of our marriage. And that dream come to manifestation. Yes, there is a spiritual robbers again. You are going to pray against every spiritual robbers aside against your breakthrough. Hey, my dear brother, you see, what I am telling you is very real. I can tell you a lot of testimony how we we minister to people. And then after the prayer, they will tell us what the root cause, what happened in their dream life, that all this began to manifest. You, are, you saw there was a particular brother. He had been praying and been praying and been praying. He had a master degree. He had a PhD. Anytime the brother got a job, anytime he got a job, he will lose that job every... Uh, he will not stay long in that job for one month. After one month, he will lose that job. And he had a master degree. He has a PhD again, and he will have a job. In fact, he got a job. Between one month, they sack him because money was missing in his, uh, in his uh, apartment and all that. And they say he's the one that took the money. Why is he still the world? They sacked him brother again. The man has PhD and also a master degree. But do you know that the enemy of breakthrough? Doesn't want anything. No, that's why you have the certificates. That's why you have what what can give him a better life. But spiritual robbers not allow him to enjoy it. You are going to pray. Every spiritual robbers are sad against your breakthrough in life. Oh God, I command their power to die. Amen. All upon the Lord. Whatever but magic the power they are using to turn your blessing upside down, whatever power they are using to turn your blessing upside down, whatever power they are using to divert your blessing, command their power to die in the name of Jesus. Every spiritual robber, I against your blessing, call upon the Lord. I will tell you life testimony, life testimony. In my case, they have a master degree. They don't allow his spiritual robbers to not allow him to enjoy what God is what he has made for food. They are always attacking him. They call him. They don't fight to enjoy the blessing. The blessing to my own. Why can't you call upon the Lord? Call upon the Lord. Every spiritual robber has signed against your breakthrough in life. The Lord will turn them upside down. The Lord will prevail. 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 The Lord will pr
particular sister here in Nigeria over here. In fact, I was the one by the grace of God that conducted that deliverance for her. She told me that crocodile swallow a certificate after she went to school and uh, she graduated and a certificate that we used to get employment. She had a dream that crocodile swallow a certificate in that dream. And then she began to look for a job, and yet he, he's been qualified in all the job he was attending, but they will not, but they will not employ her. And then she told me, and then I said, Don't not worry, that crocodile that swallowed your certificate in your dream, he will vomit it out. And we began to pray and pray and pray. And she had another dream again that look and behold, that certificate that the crocodile swallow has been permitted. I said, Wow. I said, Then the, the door has opened, there's a breakthrough for you. Between one week, all we have submit interview, they call her, they employ her. And by the grace of God, she's not doing very well. What I am telling you is very real. It's, it's, not, it's very real. You are going to pray. Whatever the enemy has swallowed in your life, whatever they have swallowed, in your dream life, spiritually, you are going to ask the Lord, oh God, they must vomit it out. Oh God, they must vomit it out. Oh God, they must vomit it out as the shark vomited Jonah. You are going to pray whatever the enemy has swallowed in my life. Let the power of God touch them and let them vomit it out. Command them to vomit it out. Whatever they have swallowed, the power of God will touch their throat. They will vomit them quickly. They have swallowed up in your life. Pray and call upon the Lord. 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 Command them to vomit them. They have swallowed up in your life. I, my brother, my brother, my brother, my brother, my brother, my brother, pray. Pray so that we it is happening in your life is not ordinary. It is not what we tell you tonight. And we and we tell you tonight, it's not ordinary. Forces and powers are working against your life. Demons and people spirits are working against your, your, your life. And you see this happening here and here. You keep quiet. You keep talking. It's not ordinary. It's not ordinary. We are full of the law. Every darkness in your life, every crisis in your heart, every power fighting against, fighting against you spiritually, maritally, you think it's ordinary, it's not ordinary. Spirit heart, it's robbers at war. 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 All those spiritual robbers are signed against your testimony. All the spiritual robbers are signed against your miracle. All the spiritual robbers are signed against your destiny. All the spiritual robbers are signed against your marriage. All the spiritual robbers are signed against your happiness. All the spiritual robbers are signed against your joy. And you shall command your power to die. You will not be afflicted. You are qualified for that position. And then you have been waiting and waiting and waiting. You need to run back as time against your testimony. If you ask the Lord, the Lord will frustrate all their agenda. Whatever you have lost in your dream life, you can recover them today. You can recover them today. You can recover them today. Whatever victory you have lost, whatever the enemy has carried away from your life, you can regain them and recover them by the power of God. I recover. 
What happened about your marriage? You have been praying for the will of God in marriage, and the powers of darkness are saying no. They come and block your marriage, and they say you will not get married. Come and see your wife, and they see your husband spiritually. They offer your wife to offer your husband spiritually. They offer your wife, they offer your husband spiritual robbers.
the reward of prayer will be our will be ours in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. We are still on the claiming the promises Amen. of the Lord. But before I go forward, I want to remind I've not been since Sister Esther. I've been mentioning you for power three weeks now. That's not been online for our prayer. Please. Uh whoever you can help us to call on her and ask why we have not been seeing her. Today, by the grace of the Lord, we are going to go into the covenant, the covenant of God with the uh, Noah. The Bible says God bind himself to a, a covenant with Noah and his descendants, promising never to destroy the earth by flood. By flood. God give the rainbow as a sign of his promise. Uh, we will not call upon the name of the Lord. The Almighty Father, if you can make a rainbow as a sign of covenant between you and human beings, mm. then in the New Testament, you make blood of Jesus Christ as a sign to redeem me. Whatsoever mm. that is blocking me, that is blocking my way, that is blocking my marriage, that is blocking my business, that is blocking anything I lay my hand upon. You know what is concerning you, concerning uh, concerning your destiny. You know what you are praying upon the, you are praying for God for. Call upon the name of the Lord today. Always remember the blood of Jesus Christ and redeem me totally in Jesus' name. Open Amen. your mouth. Call upon the name of the Lord. Father, call upon the name, the name of, of the Jesus. Lord. What is that particular in the name of thing? Jesus. That is Lord, an hindrances you can make a sign you and your destiny. Lord, that you want to Lord, achieve this. That you want to achieve that. Sign, that you will you not destroy the earth. There is simply there is simply that there is no more blood on your Father, way. You want to go forward. There is no way. Can I tell you the blood? There is no way. Initially, you want to be initially okay. There is no way. In marriage status, you want to be, but you want to be married. Okay. 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 There's no way. In your physical situation, you want to Just 
I will not destroy the world. We destroy the world. I special grace of God, somebody dropped a prayer request on our platform. If you can remember, he said a place we should, he is going for job interview by yeah. tomorrow. That was about yes. the 28th of September. If you can remember yeah. that prayer request. That yes. he wants the people of God to pray for her, that they will be highly favored by God yeah. and by the mercy that by the mercy of God and God will, the God will favor her. And yeah. by the grace of God, she yeah. called me last two weeks. She told me that they have employed her and he has, she has been among the people that have been selected. It was in the 59th now. Uh, in fact, I even called her today that, in fact, that she will come and share the testimony by herself. So she was telling me that her phone has challenge, challenges that she wants to put the phone in order. So God be the glory that uh, we pray for her and now they have employed her already. What am yes. I telling you? God as our prayer in this platform. Please. You should, you should also, when we say submit your prayer request, we have a reason why we are saying that. You understand? We have a reason. You should write your prayer request, submit it. And there are some times that by the grace of God, I don't take the prayer request first. 
I said, sometimes I don't say the prayer, then I'll now run up with the prayer request. So please, let's always invite other people who we are coming for prayer online, Thursday and Saturday and Monday and Sunday. May the Lord bless everyone of us. Amen. And Father, we thank you once again because of the great testimony that you are doing in our midst, in our life, in this prayer platform. Thank you for the men of prayer. Thank you for the people that you have connected us together with. We bless your name because we glorify your name for great and the manifestation of your power in our midst. Thank you for your glory. Father, we see all the praises and thanks in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Father, we are Amen. we are praying and we are asking that hmm, kind every ancient box. Hmm, I see a box now. Every ancient box that they put a photograph of anybody right now online. That box, I command fire to consume such a box in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. And whatever at all Amen. may be the, the program of the enemy with that box, yeah. that they, I see like a, a like a picture, like a photograph in that box. Yeah. I command fire oh. to consume those box right now in the name of Jesus. Amen. And I decree and I declare, oh. my oh. brother, the Lord will deliver you. Amen. My sister, the Lord will remember you. Amen. And every custodian of evil ordinances, she got bad. Yeah. Hey, every custodian of evil ordinances, you yeah. evil custodian, I command this word of God upon your head and I destroy your activity from the people of God tonight on this prayer conference in Jesus' name. Amen. From tonight, I decree in your life you will be delivered from Amen. every strong man, from every powers contending with you by the authority yeah. of the Holy Ghost. I command Baba. every shame that I be limiting you be broken in Jesus' name. Amen. Yes. And for that person that normally have some terrible dreams. Okay, can you tell mommy? Terrible dreams. From tonight, every bad dream, I stop it in your life by the blood of Jesus. And every spiritual leakage, I use the blood of Jesus to block those leakages in your life in Jesus' name. Amen. I pray that goodness and mercy will manifest in your life. I Amen. Pray that Joy and satisfaction will follow you. I pray Amen. that you go from grace to grace, from power to Amen. power, from strength Amen. to strength, and Amen. we shall be there with you. Amen. Thank you, Father. And for Thank all those who are not able to connect, but they, they have the might to connect. I pray that you will you will remain, you will you will visit them, you will you will touch their life, you will you, will, you will bring them up, and Amen. then you, you you will bless them abundantly as you have blessed us tonight. In oh. Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Lord. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. Uh, Pastor, Pastor Amen. Matthew, I just remember Brother Eric. Please, can you get in touch with him? For some friends now, we have not been online. Brother Eric, please, let's get in touch with him. He's over there in Chicago. Okay. <laughs> let's try the grace. Let do not forget the Saturday prayer meeting. God will be with us in Jesus' name. Let us continue. Amen. Remember what we pray for, uh, marking it as God is doing it. And God will Amen. bless uh, His name in our life in Jesus' name. Let's Amen. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, and the love of God, 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 the love of God bless you all. Thank you, everyone. Thank you. Because of for our testimony will be full in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir.